Yo, what up gamers, you're watching video number 3 of my Iron to Diamond series. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see the rest of this series, and follow me on Twitch if you want to see the series live. The link is in the description. Okay, go, 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 go! Nice. She needed to root me. Pointless rooting Nautilus there, I think. Oh my gosh, she is so tanky though. Oh, just really don't kill her, that sucks. Yeah, it's actually so much harder to choose these level 1 kills now. <laughs> I could have, I could have definitely got her if I flashed or healed, maybe, but don't know. This is already a pretty good outcome. She can't lane anymore. She has to back. She's gonna lose a lot, even if I don't get the kill on the gold. And I, have to, and I do this without blowing any summoners. Okay, it would be fantastic if you could help me shove this. And we crash and I back for coal. Not like that. I don't think I... Wait, can I... Nah, I should be able to get coal if I get this cannon. Yes. But... No, I actually can't. I need to get both casters. Do I want to back? I think I do. Well, actually, I can get coal. Yeah, nice. Still, we should have been able to crash faster. <coughs> Why no cleanse here? Do I look like I think about my choices? Or was he? I have to do my runes in the last five seconds. Anyway, I probably still wouldn't do cleanse here. <clears throat> Ooh. Completely dead. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. Everybody just feels so tanky, man. It's so great, like I can walk up into the wave as well. And the damage is not nearly so significant. I'm much less likely to just get randomly burst down 1v3 by Zaya because I'm taking minion aggro, you know? It feel somehow it just feels like I have way more outplay potential, but I'm also way less likely to just get outplayed if I'm playing smart, you know? Like I have so many more opportunities available to me. Anyway, we don't really want to crash this. It would take me so long to crash this wave. By the time we hit the turrets, I was already going to be back in lane. We, I might as well just maintain this freeze. I was only thinning it out. Nice. Long sword, a good starting item, or is it D blade? Both are good. Not less. Oh, I was gonna ward before we all in, but he already has the opportunity. Hmm, timed that perfectly, actually. Not gonna lead to a kill opportunity though. Like I didn't wait for the shield to be done there, I was just like, yeah, it's going down now. Ow. But can Nautilus stop farming? What is he doing, man? I can do it with backing soon. <coughs> Yo, 
why are both junglers just sitting with the lane man? <laughs> what is this? You you can leave. This Warwick is not gonna turret dive us. You don't have to be here just because Warwick is here. Like I, you can tell both junglers are just sticking around because the enemy jungler is sticking around, you know? Oh shit. I'll heal him, but I don't know if it's gonna do much. We cannot play. Okay. Where's Warwick? He might be over this wall, so I don't want to tumble. Okay, he's not. Mmm, <laughs> I need this Doom Curve, man. The Thorns Blade clunk cutting it from my last hitting. There we go. Can't go for the plating here. Thorns Blade technically gonna, gonna nerf because you have more base HP. But we also have more armor. And that also makes the sustain more valuable. So did it get buffed or nerfed? I honestly don't fucking know. I have not even the slightest fucking clue. Oh, I completely forgot though. You know, I don't really like doing cold if I'm doing shield blow. Oh well. It's fine. It actually might not uh, work out bad at all. So far, it was actually pretty convenient that I just had enough for a new quiver and vamp scepter anyway. The coal hasn't really hurt me. I'm so hyped and I'll only be able to play tomorrow night. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I, I actually was so excited to play today. Like, I got up early, not just to record a video, because I wanted to be, like, early with a video. But I also, I also just genuinely was really excited to just wake up and play some League of Legends on this patch, you know? And so far, it is not disappointed. I'm having so much fun. I don't know if I'll feel the same if I play any other role, but on ADC, I'm having a lot of fun. Ooh, why is she so low? If we can dodge a Morgana Q, it might lead to a kill. It just depends how overextended Zaya is at the time. Okay, well, it can also just land on Nautilus, that's also fine. But still need a Zaya to overextend. We're just gonna freeze here, so, um... Even if we're not getting a kill here, they're just missing out on a lot of farms. So they have every incentive in the world to walk up. Thing is, they can't. Or Zaya can't, she's way too low. Well, I, she's a little bit healthier now. Why isn't she using her potions, by the way? Just check the other one. She's so likely to die on this HP if she gets hooked. <laughs> what? Oh. oh no! I fucked up the angle there. That's my bad. That did no damage, by the way. Is that because she's maxing W or just because of the durability update? Ooh, nice one. Ooh, she wasted that. <laughs> okay, man. How would you do that? They're gonna need to start taking this a little bit less seriously. It's actually sad how behind they are. I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna freeze anymore. So we, w we actively want to freeze in this kind of matchup because Nautilus can't do anything when they're on the turret, right? We keep the wave here. They have to like walk up if they want to get farmed, but they're constantly under threat by the Nautilus. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push, even though I shouldn't be pushing. Just to give them a fighting chance. I'll go for these double platings. Hopefully I got both. Yeah, fuck it. Even if we miss some farm now, it should be worth it, I think. Since it was solo platings. Oh, and they're not even shoving like they should be. They should be crashing this as fast as they can, because uh, I should be backing here. And they know that I should be backing here. Lucian soft nerf with this patch, as he has a bursty motherfucker. You would think so. Uh, when I checked, he was like... Is it... Let me check, actually. I can check the exact number when I checked. He was up 0.5%. That might have changed by now. Twitch also initially was like down 1%, but now he's suddenly up 0.1%. 
So they, we're gonna wait for more sample size, or at the time I had to probably wait for more sample size. Don't know if the numbers are better now. Actually, I can't really fight against this whip, by the way. <laughs> I wanna take it, I'm gonna take it less seriously so the game is more interesting, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna run it down. Oh shit, he is going in. Hmm, cool for Zaya. What is her build, by the way? Here with crit? Unless she's Russian collector and even that would be terrible, that just doesn't make any sense. Uh, we can probably dive her here. I have no idea if she used ult already or not. Ooh. Wow, I actually dropped a lot, I didn't notice. I forgot I had shield, but I didn't need to heal. Oh well. Right, they buffed Tourist, didn't they? I completely forgot. Holy shit, yeah. But yeah, that's a lot of third damage, got them. Nice. Yeah, Nautilus just couldn't do anything there because they were under threat. Should back here. Would be nice to see a misfortune game, but we'll see misfortune at some point today. Probably. Be careful. I want to get hit by these. What is that angle the game is making me walk at, man? Oh, I, did, I shouldn't have vaulted, my bad. Oh, wow. Well. Hitting my minions, Nautilus. Oh, God. Nah, you shouldn't. I used E. It should have been cancelled, man. Well, I'm gonna get- uh, no, actually, I guess Oracle doesn't throw- is uninterruptible, isn't it? At least uh, until he lands on someone. If anything, I need it to ult later. Oh, well. Did I like the new patch so far? It's great. I love it. Did they increase the attack speed on turrets, by any chance? Just feels like it's attacking more often. Could be wrong. Is Twitch more playable right now, do you know? It seems to be, yeah. Okay. Did I really need to ult here? Probably not. <laughs> One. Nice. Reset the lethal tempo just in time. Ooh, I actually can't get her. She's got a Nimbus Cloak. Ow. <laughs> there goes my shield bow again. Which might screw me if her work comes again.
<clears throat> okay, we'll probably do Phantom Dancer second item. Or, sorry, third item. After the Gensus. Which then wouldn't be a bad purchase, but... But like my survivability on this patch should be fine without the wood scent. Is my team gonna do much here? Nope. Hmm, I'll go mid. Oh yeah, I wonder if average game times are gonna go up, by the way. I think they should. Damn. Okay, he died. And I got my treasure hunter stack. I didn't need to ult my bad. That was a sh massive shutdown, actually. What the hell? I didn't need that. Oh, what the hell? Okay, maybe I do. What the fuck is he going on top lane? What the fuck? Actually, I can... If she does happen to get this in I'll actually upgrade this to Renance instead. Wait, fuck. I need to know in advance, though. Nah, she's not going to get this, right? Nah, not if I go for her. Wait, fuck. No, she actually might get it, though. Shit. Ah, uh, it's fine. I'll have enough wave clearing without Renance, I think. Okay, I don't have ult, she probably does, I imagine. Nice. Holy shit, I don't know how she got such an early in I guess I really was mid, to be fair. Nobody else decided to... Do anything to the Lowy. That's fine. This, uh, this inhib is too early for taking the Baron, and even when the Baron is up... Uh, it's still like the top lane inhib, so it's like the least valuable inhib to take, I think. Unless you're going for Drake Soul. Which is not on the table right now. So at the moment, this might just be really free farm for me. Because uh, I don't struggle to farm these waves at all. I melt the fucking super minions. I think I'm actually the, maybe the best ADC for dealing with this. Fuck melt right now. Oh, I thought she was dead there. There we go. Nice, he left the kill for me. He didn't attack Alawi, he knew it wasn't necessary. I'm surprised to see that because even diamond supports would generally just hit the Alawi there. Yeah, I really didn't need Renance. Phantom Dancer worked out better. Question is, do I want Renance now or do I want Farkanen? I also just go with Sand. Which is technically the best choice. I guess I'll do that. Just set a good example. Should not have tried to find me there. Now it is I who 
Fuck for it, might kill me again. Damn it. He had ult there, didn't he? I think he just ulted me right as he died. Figured he would have used that on a rally while, while I wasn't looking. Thank you for too long. Guess I can't really go for that. I'll just take their camps. Okay, just Raptors then. I think I'll do Farcon and actually lost item. My one auto poke should be pretty good at this stage, just because I'm so ahead. <laughs> my god, look at my attack speed without any lethal tempo procs. One auto? Just one, one auto so I can see the damage. There we go. It's a lot of damage. <clears throat> that looks pretty good, this patch, no? Yeah. <laughs> pretty good. Second best ADC, or maybe first. Kogma seems really good as well, though. Oh, I don't want to get Nautilus ulted. <laughs> I guess we'll just kill them and then. I was gonna do Baron. Yeah. Hopefully we can end. This game is just boring with how ahead I am. Oh yeah, there we go. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to see the rest of this series. And follow me on Twitch if you want to see the series live. The link is in the description.